Give me three top tips you'd recommend somebody consider when they're thinking about exiting their business. Am I allowed to say they should come and have a conversation with us? Of course you are. Get help is absolutely fine. <laughs> yeah. Um, of all of the guests I've had on the podcast, you know, the, the common theme is the sooner you start preparing for exit, the better off you'll be and the, the, the greater maximize or the, the more you can increase the valuation of your business. Mm. Um, I've also had a number of owners go, hey, look, hey, I, I, I first approached you because I wanted to get out of the business. I'd had enough. I was stressed to the eyeballs. The business had taken over my life. I, I just couldn't see a future. I didn't know where to take it next. I'm now back in control of the business and, and I'm working a healthy 30, 40 hours a week. I love it. Do you mind if we don't sell it? And I go, look, no worries. I'm, I'm, I'm not taking a, a, a clip on, on your exit. <clears throat> so we need to get a, an early start is, is one tip. The, the sooner you start, the better. You said begin with the end in mind. You need to get clear what it is you want to do next. You know, we need to know what your goals and aspirations are and, and you know, what floats your boat. Because what, one of the things we know about entrepreneurs is once they grasp onto a new vision of what they're going to do next, get out of their way because they're going to make it happen. So if they, they know what they're going to do next after the business, then once they're clear on that and they've grabbed hold of that new vision, they're, they're running for it and then you know they're not going to stall the exit. <clears throat> Um, the, another thing would be, yeah, look, the reality is the bigger your business is, the, the, the more valuable it is and the more enjoyable it is to run. I get a lot of messages from business owners who go, look, you, I just can't find good people. I, you know, they you know, we can't get good people in the marketplace. And it always comes down to the leaders. You know, the, the good people are looking for good leaders. So invest in yourself, in your leadership styles, in the skills you've got to transition yourself out of being in the business to on the business. <laughs>